Never understood what the term roguelike actually means. Um, so the explanation, way, way back when, on the days of the Spectrum, like, uh, Spectrum computer, actually, ZX Spectrum, sorry, there was a game known as Rogue. It was a dungeon crawl. It was a dungeon crawler set in a high fantasy world, where your big objective was to see how far you could get within a randomly generated dungeon. The appeal of Rogue was that every time you went in, the entire layout of the dungeon changed. The enemies you fought, the loot that you could get, and you never know, knew what type of loot you would get until you started progressing through it. However, if you per if your character perished, then you would start all the way back at the start of the dungeon. It's become an entire genre now in that of uh, games with this type of terminal uh, terminal progression, if that makes sense. I I don't know that I don't remember the exact word. In essence, roguelike as a word means similar to the uh, to the ZX Spectrum game Rogue. Meanwhile, a rogue light, L-I-T-E instead of L-I-K-E, is a game that takes the same uh, essence of rogue, but also keeps newer players in mind, or just players who just want to have fun with the game. To do so, they introduce something called meta progression. Essentially, as you play, you gain a currency. In this case, it's ether, I believe it is. Yeah. And in between runs, we could spend this ether to get permanent upgrades to make future runs easier. That's the essence of meta progression. A means to help players who aren't great at games do a little better and enjoy the game a little more. The more you screw... Come on. Okay. Annihilated. As opposed to souls like where if you're not so great, then fuck you. <laughs> yeah. Essentially. The souls like games have a bit more of a pattern of dodge recognition, is it dodging and pattern recognition? They look hard, but they're a lot easier than you think they are. Well, not a lot easier, but a little easier. Provided you're making liberal use of your guard and dodge buttons, your defensive options, you should do fine. And that, I feel like, separates amateur gamers from uh, intermediates and experts. Guarding. Playing, knowing that in order to do well, screw this game! I wasn't aiming for that prick! To do well, you need to be able to play defensively, at least somewhat. There's a concept of mixing offense and defense in fighting games known as Yomi. It's a fundamental concept that all fighting games and just intermediate and expert play, period, tends to have. Ow. Essentially, if you're on the offense, then you should be celebrated for being on the offense. If you're on the defense, then you should be celebrated for not just defending against the oppression, but also being able to rupture the opponent's po the opponent's form. I 
I'd say a game like this is the perfect example of what exactly Yomi is as a concept. Well See how the Souls player who learns all the tricks and min-maxing, picking best equipment. Yeah, it... <laughs> fair. I do get the appeal. Giant, the giant sword goes smash. Me? Give me a spear? Because I like poking at vulnerabilities. I like... Just, in my eyes, the spear is the perfect offensive and defensive weapon. Because you're incentivized for playing defensively. You're incentivized for keeping to the edge of the opponent's range and chipping them. Specifically... Woo! I blocked that. Bull. Just, you're incentivized for playing defensively, keeping to the edge of the opponent's range, and gimmicking them, essentially. Being able to shut them down before they even get a chance. Ah, crap. Shit. Back up. Play this like a survivalist. Fantastic work. I've lost 4 HP, so I think I know what I'm going to be taking. Just to keep myself maintained. Assuming you're not backed up against a wall. Pretty much. Oh, fuck. I should have kept my soul flame for this prick. Oh, well. In the worst case scenario, I do have an emergency button. Everyone likes medieval fantasies, usually all sword goes swish. Yeah. Just... Maybe I'm strange in that respect. Give me a spear, because it's peak efficiency for anything semi-medieval. Ah. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Whoop. 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 You got to be kidding. Ugh. Whoop. Someone got him. Chew on that. Play this carefully. God damn it. Uh, Sword is your nickel plated revolver. Pretty much. Swords are boring, bland, they're uninteresting, they're overhyped. If you need better swinging power, use an axe. If you need, if you need to poke enemy, is if you want to shut down enemies before they get a chance to hit you back, use a spear. Hello, or if you have good, a good eyesight and aim, a bow, a crossbow. Hell, a sling is useful. Discombobulate your opponent. And yes, I said boo. Actually, what's the upgrade on this, anyway? <laughs> the first hit with this weapon deals extra guard damage and interrupts basic attacks. Fuck yes! I've been doing that already!
I've already been gut punching opponents. Why not make it a perk? Fucking jab. Two on that. The spear is the king of medieval battle. The exactly. <laughs> Just. <laughs> A moment to just empty gab for a moment. If I could make a game, I know precisely the type of game I'd want to make. It would be something like Mega Man Star Force, but a roguelike. Where your com your most common weapons aren't swords. If anything, swords are the rarest weapon in the game because they're they have no advantages and disadvantages. Every other weapon has some clear cut advantage disadvantage, or quirk that you need to work with. Say you had a gun. Say you had a gun. You could hold down- you could hold down the button to fire it- just- you could hold down the button to fire it, but you would only have so much ammo. After a point, you would need to wait for a few seconds- for a few seconds to use the quote-unquote charged action to reload the gun and get your ammo back up. For a bow, holding down the button charges up- would charge up your aim. It would, like, uh, charge up your, uh, Attack. Letting go would fire it. The more you charge, the faster the attack, the more damage it deals, etc, etc. Tapping the button. Sim basic. Simple. Somewhat quick, but not great. I know exactly what I'm taking. Because Soulburn is just Soulburn. All the interesting variations on pole arms, like the English bl Exactly! Just, the spear is the ubiquitous weapon. It's perfect for every situation. Well, every situation except guarding, really. But even then, if you're using your spear correctly, you don't need to guard. Because at that point, the enemy's already dead. Double kill. Actually, every 20 seconds. Okay. So in other words... I want to duel this guy and extend it for as long as possible. Just so I could do that. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Okay, Sucker Punch makes this knuckle much more worthwhile. Well yes, Afo, this game. I'm loving it. Also, hope you're doing well. Okay, extra combo. Alter alternating attacks with your other weapon causes this weapon to deal extra guard damage. Uh hmm. I could see the appeal in this from the knuckle duster. The idea being, like... You disrupt- you use the knuckle of the sucker punch to disrupt the guard, open them up- open them up, deal some extra- deal some extra damage, and then knuckle- knuckle them once all that's finished, just so you can get the extra chip on their armor the next time around. But I also feel like combo limit is just across the board better. Because at least with the combo limit, I can afford to poke the enemy one more time with my- Danger. There's tactics to this. <clears throat> Shh. 
shit, I better not have used that. No, I don't think I did. Good. Because I think this flashes when it's ready. Nice try. Yeah, save my soul burn, just in case. Headbutt! I'm done playing honorable. Come on! Sucker punch. Ugh. There we go. Much better. Headbutt! Mm. Back up! Oh, come on! Nice try. Good work. Give him at least a little bit of honor and death. I'm too down on HP. I'll still be two down on HP, but at least have one more HP. That might be better in the long run. Sow the seeds of tomorrow. That's my ma that's my maxim. Yes, yes, I know. Parrying won't be enough. Avoid its attacks. Easier said than done. Headbutt! Crap. Excellent! <laughs> An honorable battle. That was a lot better than my usual attempts. Now for the rest of this to go topsy turvy. That's some ether. Quite a lot. Blocking. Game, shut up. Sure, blocking with this weapon. Fuck. Yeah, and the sockets are full. So I guess I'm taking the ether. I'm fine with that. Money. I hope I get a weapon. Because I do know for a fact, the latest update for this game, which happened a few months ago, adds the two-handed weapons. Headbutt. Crap. Nice try. Okay. One, two, three, four. Damn it. Ha. Much better. That's what I'm talking about. This is my fury. Damn it.
coin. Ugh, that was close. I'm gonna need some HP. No brainer. This looks like a boss arena. Oh good. This is gonna suck. What is it doing? Something. Never mind. Questions for later. Chill on that. I'm at least getting an early chip on its HP. Excuse me? Oh, that's not fair. Get back here, you coward! Oh, great. Revenants, too? Focus week. Ah. Okay. I see you up there. You gotta come down? Got you. Watch out. Really? That's all you got? None effective attack. Crap. Ugh. That's a lot. I almost had it all. I think I chipped it down halfway. That's pretty good. I hope I got something new in the forge. Because I've got ether to spend. You are close, champion. I believe in you. Oh? Notices your mace? Maximum health one. Blocking with this weapon grants an extra supercharge. I'm still taking the suckle duster. But. Increased guard damage. I can't pay for the next upgrade because it costs a lot. Five health damage. And how much is, say, the axes? Seven. And the soul knife. Five. Okay. Sure, let's try a mace. I'll be the ace of mace. 
give them all the pepper spray. Spray them full of pepper. And this also gives me a lot of HP, I'm just realizing. Decent? Oh! Okay, interesting. Not a high combo limit, though. So, I'm gonna need to tweak that first chance I can get. <laughs> That's not pepper spray at all! Is it, Steve? Gentlemen, behold! Mace! <laughs> uh, okay, actually, what is the hyper on this? Soul burn. Oh. Oh my. Game, you know how to seduce me. Game knows how to seduce me. Put soul burn on everything. Yo, dog, we heard you like soul burn, so you put some soul burn on your soul burn, so you can burn your soul. Will you burn your soul? Block this one. Yeah. Eat that. Knuckle down. Fantastic work. <sighs> and what did we have for this time? Extra HP. Bruh, I have, like, six. <sighs> Alternate attacks with the other weapon causes this one to deal guard damage. Sure. And the next chance I can get a soul burn gem, I'm putting it on the Suckle Duster. Because Knuckle plus soul burn makes it kind of disgusting. I also need some more combo, because two is powder. What? That is too fun to do. That'll chip you down. Come on. Not great, but hey. Come on. Nice try. Ugh. What? Damn it. Yeah, this thing ain't too great for blocking attacks, is the issue. It's a little too wiggly. You can call me Knuckles. I'm like Sonic, you know, chuckle. I'd rather flex my knuckles. I'm hard as knuckles, and it ain't hard to chuckle. I break him down whether they knuckles or knuckles. First knuckle, first chuckle, first knuckle, first chuckle. Born on an island in the knuckles. My doo doo flows. <laughs> Streaking. <laughs> Cleanse yourself. No. <laughs> I want to know how many people understand that reference. Damn it. Almost out. Headbutt! Hello, you! Not great.
It's great for interrupting... It's great for all the guard damage, but that's about it. Lancing blow. But at least the last hit worked. What do we have here? Max health. Don't really need that. Game, stop it. This is the third time you've given me this set. Shut up. Actually, I probably should have taken the ether, but you know what? Fuck it. Oh, for the love of you, Drossel. Okay, good. Got it, at least. Ugh! You jerk. That was close. Mace enemies are still a pain in the ass. Lancing below. Ugh. This isn't good. Do. I blocked that! Bullshit! Okay, take a few moments to drink the water, me. If I knew any game that would give me a serious case of Wii-itis, this would be it. Oh, God. I love it, though. Welcome back, champion. Seriously? One? Screw you. Whatever. Actually, thinking about it, I might want to change the knuckle over to my left hand.
because swinging with the offhand is a little tricky. What? Fine. Good work. Okay. Combo rate. Oh yeah. I need combo. With a set like this, I desperately need com good combo. Nice try. Damn it. Returned to dust. Okay. Dash rec really mid HP. Because dash recovery speed, okay, that does sound nice. But I'm not using dashes as much as you think I am. I should be. But just because I should be, doesn't mean I will be. Yeah, with the mace, it's impossible to block that double. It moves just a hair too quick. So every time I see that, I'm just gonna need to backpedal. Screw off game. <laughs> 